you like this guy and things are going well, but he isn't opening up emotionally. You may feel ready to go deeper, maybe even commit, but you feel like he has some blockage. So what to do when you like the guy, things are going well, progressing, yet he is not opening up emotionally? That's what we'll discuss in this video. Hi, my love, my name is Magda Kay. I am intimacy expert and welcome to my channel where we discuss everything related to having the most beautiful and fulfilling intimate life. And today's topic is something that a lot of women have experienced and maybe you're experiencing it right now. So you met a guy and things are moving forward, you like him, but he's not opening up emotionally. So probably like most women, you may have tried talking to him, trying to understand what is it, does he feel safe, is there anything that he needs so that he can open up more. But here's the thing, it's not your job to open him up, it's not your job to make him feel safe, and it's not your job to make him feel not pressured. The truth is that if he wants to open up emotionally, he will. Look, if we want anything, we find a way, we make it happen. But if there's something we don't wanna do, we find excuses. So if he feels not safe or if he feels too pressured to open up emotionally to you, that doesn't mean that he feels too pressured or not safe to open up. What it means is that he's not ready to open up. Look, it's like me saying that I really wish I could work out, but I'm just too tired. Like if I only wasn't so tired. Well, if I really wanted to work out, I would make sure to get enough sleep the night before. I wouldn't be up until 1 a.m. watching Netflix. Our actions reflect what we truly want. And the thing is that as women, we allow men to have excuses, and even more, we take responsibility for that. So if he says he feels too pressured, we think we did something wrong, that we pushed too much, and so we think that we have to back off and give him space. Why is it that as women, we are so fast to assume that it's something that we did that was wrong and that we need to do something differently. Why can't we look at it the other way around that you wanting him to open up emotionally is perfectly normal, healthy and fine and it's him not doing this that it's something that needs to change. So as most women, right, in these moments we feel, oh my God, we can lose him, we're pushing too much, so we step away, give him more space and guess what? Now he doesn't have to open up. <laughs> See, if there is something you don't wanna do and you don't feel that you have to do it, you won't. This doesn't make him an asshole. It just makes him human. But if you want emotional intimacy, it also makes him someone not for you. In these moments, this is when you need to put your boundaries up and communicate it. Look, this is what I need. This is important for me. If you want to be with me, that's what I require. And if it's not something you can or want to give, that's okay, but we need to part ways. I want you to think of emotional openness a little bit differently. It isn't something that we develop in a relationship. It's something you already need to have. It's like a prerequisite to be in a relationship. Think for a moment. Imagine I need to hire someone to do my social media. So I need a person who knows how Instagram works. If they don't know how to work with Instagram, they will not be able to do the job that I need them for. And also remember that no matter how amazing this job may be, if they don't have the skill, they're not magically going to develop it. So it's the same with your man. If he doesn't have the skill to open up, it doesn't matter how amazing you are, he still will not be able to do that. There are certain things that are required for us to be in a relationship. We have to know certain things. We have to do and embody certain things. And emotional openness is one of them. Because if you don't have emotional openness, you don't have real intimacy and the depth. And what is a relationship without the depth and intimacy? 
it's not a relationship so if he is not opening up emotionally to you it means that he still has some work to do but it's his work not yours no amount of convincing delicious dinners or amazing blowjobs is going to magically give him the skill that he needs to develop I know that moments like this can be really scary because you're facing the possibility that you may have to break up. But I want you to remember that there are men who can open up to you, who can meet you on those deeper levels. And if you do want intimacy and depth in your relationship, then you do need a partner who can open up to you. So this is the moment again, like I said, to put your boundaries up, Choose your well-being, prioritize your happiness. You deserve to be met so deeply. My love, I hope that you enjoyed this video and that it inspired you. And if you did like it, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel for more videos like that. Bye.